I have a friend today, a very lazy one. I'm gonna have to do it. Oh. Here's my little work outfit before I go take a shower and clean up this mess. And then here are these Ikea shoe shelves that we're going to put here to get rid of all of this. So it's going to get rid of this little entry table. We keep his shoes here because we really don't have good storage for his shoes in his closet. So all his work shoes that he wears, all his like dressy shoes are out here. And then these are things that I'm going to donate from this closet because we're busy this weekend kind of decluttering the house and this doesn't go here. The vacuum goes here. This used to be a closet with shelves all the way up and it was kind of like our linen closet but it was really a hot mess and it was just a junky like closet and I have gotten way too many jackets and I thought what if we had like a roll coat closet we could put our jackets in there i.e. my jackets. Uh, we could put another bar here but then it would be like you open the door and the coats are like right here in your face. So it, it comes um, it get, goes a little deeper here so there's a little bit there's a little bit of room where you can push them back but yeah, it worked out nicely because I was able to get all my coats out of my closet. And um, and now we have a place for the vacuum because the vacuum kind of lived in all the rooms in the house. And then, of course, filters and stuff. So just kind of miscellaneous lunch provided by you. you. I just got home from Angelo's uh, little tutoring thing that we take him to on Tuesdays. But it actually was moved to Monday because um, she's teaching like a CPR class. And so, anywho. Um, I'm about to cook dinner and it's like 6.46 so hopefully it won't be too late. I had pet sitting today so I had to run do that. And then Alfredo is building the Ikea stuff that I think I showed y'all earlier today that was behind me um, for the entry table. So I don't know if it's, any of it's going to get done tonight but it looks like he's, he's getting somewhere. I got myself together and I actually filmed these nails. Um, so look out for that video. I don't want to tell you too much about it but I'm going to do this side after dinner hopefully. Um, and finish filming so I can post that tonight or tomorrow. Oh. Yum. Project number... <laughs> I'm about to leave to run some errands but I wanted to show y'all my little outfit I put together <laughs> even though I feel like I don't know man the last couple of times I've been trying to get dressed I don't even want to get dressed but anyways um I just put my hair back because I still haven't washed it but I took a shower did my eyebrows this little black and white flannel from Target that I got uh probably last year some leggings and then my little um, lug sole boots. So, um, I ran a couple of errands today. I didn't work out. I was able to post a video that I filmed doing these nails on my YouTube this morning. I had to go to Target because Aiden is going to the Mavs game tonight with a friend. Like, one of our family friends wants to take him to the Mavs game tonight. So, we're like, yeah, sure, he'd love to go. They're season ticket holders, I think. And so, um, he um, asked if he could take him, and we're like, yeah. So I went and got him. So that's the reason I went to Target. I went to go find him a shirt or jersey. Here's the shirt. Um, and 77 is Luca, I think is his name. I don't know how to say his last name. Alfredo so called me to tell me that he is um, running to the house real quick because the inspector is there inspecting all the things that failed us last time. And one of them was an alarm that um, has to beep or make an uh, alarm noise when you open the back door, which leads to the backyard because of the pool. So they're going in there. Um, he's having to rush over there because I need to verify that is um, in place. And Angelo so says he likes a girl at school and she likes him back, but they're not boyfriend and girlfriend. So I wanted to get her something special for Valentine's. So I got her this to go with his little Valentine's. Hopefully they get here in time because I ordered them from Minted and they haven't shipped them yet. And it's Tuesday and their party's Friday. And so I emailed them today and I said, I ordered them on the first and they haven't even shipped. It's still saying it's processed. And so uh, somebody got back to me and said, I'm so sorry. I'm going to look into it. I'm going to, I changed it to rush, which is overnight. And hopefully they get them done 
within the next day or so and I should be able to get them by Friday but I don't know it's cutting it really close so I, I may have to buy some just generic ones at the store if there's any left by the time I find out if they have them or not. I'll show you what I got from Target and Ross real quick. Um, I got a little Valentine's card for Alfredo. I got a new mug which I'm super excited about. Can you see it a little better? I got a little white tank top that I was thinking about using for under slip dresses. Maybe a Valentine's look with a black slip dress from Zara that I think y'all have seen and I did a collective haul on. And then a long sleeve like Henley. I've been needing a like white one but this is cream. This will do. I got this in a medium. And then I was really excited about what I found at Ross because but this would be cute to style this week um, or even Monday during the day for Valentine's. It's like this pastel pink checkered print. This looks very similar to something that's eight, ooh, in H&M right now, which is like this pastel kind of watercolor looking print. And so I got this in a medium to kind of get the oversized feel, but it would be cute over... Um, a, I have a workout set that's in like this color from Target, so maybe just wearing it over it when I go to carpool and then taking it off when I come home. Super excited about this. I ordered these because our old knife set is not looking very hot these days, and I want to switch everything to gold in my kitchen. Very nice. And I ordered this um, red workout set. Oh, material feels kind of weird. I don't know how much I like it. It's a little bit of a different material. It's not the usual rib material like this part of it that I normally get from Amazon. Um, it does have the ribbed part right here, but this is smooth. And it, it almost looks like... Oh, it has a little button seam, so maybe it does a little butt lifting action. We shall see. So this is our old knife like situation, and... If you look at these, they are like rubbing off here. It does come with the sharpener also for the knife. I also got these in the mail that I had ordered for the our little trip to Colorado. But this is an umbrella that's gonna go outside on the actual like floor. They're making like a hole in the in the ground, so it's not gonna be like in between like a table or anything. It's just gonna be there. And we got one snowsuit in. This is Angelo's. morning it's wednesday and i'm about to work out but amazon already delivered a package early today and i bought these little squishies um for the kids to add to their valentine oh my gosh they're so cute so they come in these little individual packs and they're kind of like they're exactly what they're called squishies so you just squish them Oh, and also I tried this little set from Amazon on and it did not fit. Not one bit. <laughs> so I always go for a medium, but this time I, from reading the reviews, I decided to go with a small. And um, no, it does not fit here and it does not fit here. So I'm going to go with the medium. I was actually kind of debating on going with the large. That's how tight it was. So I don't know. I may go with the large. We shall see. Just finished working out. This is a little top from Ross that I got yesterday. I think I shared it with y'all. Yeah, it was like $7. <clears throat> and it's like a little like crop top and I got, I got it in a large because I did want it oversized and I planned to, I actually didn't plan to do this but I ended up tucking it in like this and I liked it um, much better as far as like the look I was going for. I'm wanting to get like more graphic shirts, especially for working out and just throwing over now that like it's gonna get warmer here in the spring and summer. I don't wanna just walk around in like a sports bra. But um, normally what I would put over is like a little, like a light sweatshirt. And I have, I'm not going to do that in the summer. So, anywho, I've been trying to find more of these. But like I went to Target and I was going to pick some up. But they were like 13 bucks. 
And I was like, oh, I'm gonna see if Ross has anything. And so if you just go up a few sizes in the women's sections for some graphics, even if they're cropped, like you can still make them work. Cause this is not, this would, if I was wearing this with like real jeans, um, I still wear high-waisted ones, so it would like cover everything. But um, again, planning to wear it as like workout shirts. And I've been meaning to go to um, the thrift store to just find some and see if I can find some like really nice worn in ones that aren't too like like not stained and stuff so. i'm gonna make myself some coffee and some breakfast and um gonna use my cute little mug and, oh and they're putting in the plaster today in the pool so let me show y'all so i let chloe on this couch now she just thinks she owns the couch don't you girl she's the sweetest girl who's the sweetest girl and i think she's really liking my my new nails too huh girlfriend huh girlfriend Oh, my sweet girl. Okay, back to it. I was going to show y'all. Oh, sorry. I got your leg. Look, they're working. So I normally always eat um, bagels with egg. That's like my preferred breakfast, um, especially when I'm working out because I feel like I want to intake the extra calories when I'm working out. And then I'll do one... I'll do one bagel with the egg whites and sriracha, and then I'll do this like sweeter bagel with coffee. I'm not saying this is the right thing or wrong thing to do, but that's just what I eat. Anywho, here's my cup, my cute little cup, and then um, my breakfast. So I'm going to eat. Okay, look, <laughs> I did uh, curling. Wait, I did curlers in my hair today, so it looks like big Texas hair. Huh? <laughs> I didn't know how it was going to come out, but I like it. I'll just, I'll wear it. And i um, wearing this little, the Henley that I got from Target yesterday. My little jean jacket, some old joggers from Old Navy. And then I did my green Converse because I wanted to wear something casual. I'm about to go run errands. These are the books I got. Franken crayon for Angelo. Clark the shark afraid of the dark for Angelo. And this one is Billy's booger. Yeah, I think you'll like that. And then I got this one for Aiden because he says they're learning about the galaxy. So I thought I'd get him this moon book for him to read. It's a pretty thick read. Like, it's got lots of stuff he can learn about. Could we sip in it? No, it's curing. <laughs> Look at Chloe's paw. Oh my gosh. I don't know if you can tell. Oh, it looks weird on the camera. Look. You see? Okay, my face looks crazy because I was wearing a mask and now my makeup's gone. But um, I'll share some of the things that I bought while I was doing my errands today and um, some packages that came in today. But also I'm having a snack because I'm hungry. It was a family dollar because I wanted to get some a package envelope, which I normally get there but didn't have any. So I ended up going to the um, U.S. Postal Service, which they had them there. But I found these. They're two little packs. I think they were three. Yeah. It was three dollars for each pack, and I think these are pretty nice looking flowers. I got a little mug. This was two dollars, and it says liquid motivation in this gray color. I thought that was super cute. These to put in the kids' little Valentine's stuff. And then I got a lotion, uh, the the Lubiderm Advanced Therapy Lotion, and I heard like the fragrance, like lotions that have fragrance, typically dry you out more because of what's in it. So, anywho, I thought I'd get like one of these um i was looking for this one or the aquaphor so this or aquaphor i've been um, kind of looking for and i just forget when i go but i just happen to be looking in, like the makeup aisle and the lotions are right there and so i went and got some in i like this one it has like just like an old lady <laughs> like an old lady lotion as well so it doesn't have any fragrance and if this isn't giving you nice vibes i don't know what is but i got this dress from a little boutique over here called upscale it's in the shopping center of Sam Moon. I'm telling you a little quiet because Aiden, Aiden is taking a nap. So if I'm not being as loud, it's because of that. But um, it's a mixture of like a chiffon clear fabric and then 
uh, velvety material. And then it has the little cowl neck, the little cross, and it's like a maxi. It's like a maybe midi, it's past midi, T-length maybe is what it's called. It's, it's almost, it's, for me it's almost a maxi, but my entire foot is exposed. But I'll try this on for y'all later to show y'all. This is what I'm going to wear for Valentine's. Went to Walmart to find the kids something to put their Valentine's in. So this is what I found because there was some I got a couple of Amazon packages. But red hoodies I got for oh I'm glad they got here. These are red hoodies for the boys to wear on Friday for Valentine's Day because I didn't find anything at the store for them. And so they have these uh, hoodies in black that we got for Halloween, and they're just the Amazon Essential brand. And so I got these since they were on Prime. And their little um, Christmas. Their little Valentine's parties are Friday, so I wanted them to have something red to wear. And I don't know if they're gonna wear their uniform or not, so they can just throw it on over it. It's my socks. <laughs> it's so random. But um, I've been taking, I've been using my husband's socks, um, these like crew socks to wear with like um, your leggings. So I've been using my husband's because I didn't actually have any, and so I finally got some. Even though I was at Walmart the other day. Um, I almost got a pack, but it was like 20 bucks for a pack of socks, and I'm like, so I found these for $10 on Amazon. Alright, on to the good stuff. Looks like my Shein stuff got here. I've been wanting to get one of these shirts. I'm, I know it's a knockoff of a designer, but I don't know the designer. Um, it has the little, like, sweetheart neckline, and it goes further on, like, the shoulders, and then long in the front and back, but then kind of has this cut that goes up the sides. Um, a pair of green pants. Ooh, I'm excited for these. I got them in an extra small because I wanted to fit the back end. Um, but this little waist right here looks a little snug. Um, but they look really cute. The material feels not the best. Satin. It's obviously not satin. But... Oh, and then I got a sweatsuit. I forgot I got this. I got a small. Was it a small? Yeah. Oh, I do not like this top part, but it is a sweatsuit in this like cream color. It's a nice size for a small. It already has an oversized fit, so I went with the small. Okay. It is very tight here, but hear me out. If I wear them really high on my waist, try not to wake up Aiden. They actually fit really nicely. I like it. It's like really snug around here. Like, so you can, wherever you put it, it's not going to move. And then here's what the pants look like. Really kind of like oversized. They don't taper at all at the bottom. So it's like a true sweatpant. That's how they fit me. Yes, here's this little dress. It's very like low because of the cowl, cowl neck that it has but it's really cute and then this is the length on me obviously maybe it would be more like this on somebody that's taller but see what shoe that would wear with it it would go with strappy so i would definitely wear these and then um i have like this kind of sherpa fur looking coat from shein that i would wear with it but quite the contraption Okay, don't mind my appearance because I look a mess, but I've been cleaning and I just finished the living room and now I'm going to move on to, and I already did my bedroom and now I'm going to move on to the boys room. The, I feel like the living room looks so much bigger now that we got rid of that other piece and this is so flush to the wall, it really kind of opens up the space. Um, I really like that, so I just want to show you all that. So their little cards came in the mail today, yay, this is Angelo's. And this is Aiden's. And I'm going to attach these little squishies to them. I'm just going to staple them to the back of the package. And it's my um, shoes that I got from Just Fab. So let me show you all. 10%. These were all on sale. So I took advantage from Just Fab and I had a credit. So these are just some cream combat boots and like a faux leather, but they're really soft and they have a zipper on the side, which is nice. 
excited to style these. Probably with this new pastel sweaters from Ross. Okay, these are super cute and really soft. Mm, I like them. Okay, and then these I got for the summer, also on sale. I think these were like $10 or something. They're pretty cheap, but I thought this was cool because it's a wedge kind of or a thick block heel. Okay, and lastly, <laughs> these little like loafer style shoes. And I don't know. Here. I don't know how I feel about them, um, but um, I have the other like mule style loafers like this, but I kind of am unsure when I see them in person. I'm going to look a little bit better on the foot, maybe with some jeans, a colored shirt, I don't know. No. I've been eyeing some coach ones, but they're $100, so I figured I'd try on. And I tried these. They're really inexpensive to see how much I actually wear them. I got these boots that I found from... A girl on TikTok, and then when I tried to order them, they didn't have my size. So I did a Google search um, of the image, and I found them on another website. So let me show you. I didn't know they were the Cupid brand, which is you know, an affordable brand. And they're always like faux leather. It's not real leather. But these are the boots. They're a Cognac Tall boot. Let me try them on. Okay. I really like these. The shape of them is really nice and it fits good around the leg a little bit. You know, I have space there, but it's not like crazy. And then um, it goes up on the sides here. See how it goes up higher here than here. And they are really soft. But they're also very like cushiony inside. Not like the bottom, but like around here. And they're not uncomfortable by any means. They're really, oh my God, I said just perfect. They're really nice. I really like Hello them. and happy Friday. I just went outside to try to take a photo of my outfit. I put on like all my like love or heart stuff. My, lo my love ring, excuse me, my love ring that I technically wear all the time. I popped off a nail, so I'm gonna try to fix that later. Um, my little love necklace. I think I got this one last year. And then this was a Stella and Dot like little choker. Um, I realized I didn't put lipstick on, but it's okay. I'm going to go get the boys. I haven't gone on all day because the pool is officially filled. Derek, who is the guy that's been doing all our, like, keeping us up to date with everything that's happening next with the pool, he was here and he was turning on the pool, doing things for the pool, uh, Download, uh, told me to download the app, showed me how, like, the light works because we're going to get pool school from John, who um, will come at some point where me and Alfredo came in with them. So we talk about all of the pool stuff. So yeah, I'm ready. I had a really rough night last night because um, I couldn't sleep. I started from a period. And then we were waking up every hour on the hour while I was checking the cameras to see if the pool was filled to where it was supposed to be. And it wasn't filled until like after I came back from school. So it literally has been on since 9 a.m. yesterday. Our water bill is gonna be redonkulous. Um, but it's filled and he said we can get in as early as tomorrow in it but yeah that's it that just that's what's been going on today I haven't done much here's my little outfit a ross little sweater it's a medium and it's already oversized so i'm just kind of wearing it off the shoulder this little tank is from amazon it's a little snug could have wore a medium um, but it is cropped so it just goes to here and then this little oversized sweater covers everything which is nice I don't want all that to show. And then these are the Target wide leg crop jeans that I got, I think last, yeah, I definitely got them last year. Um, and I just uh, folded them. I did a little fold in the back and then I folded them to make them a little bit more narrow when I fold them. So that's my little outfit. I got home early today. I had pet stains, so I've been coming in and out. That's probably why I haven't been on here very often. And then I got Chipotle tonight. The kids are already eating in separate rooms. I'll see y'all next week. I never say goodbye. I always just cut off the vlog abruptly. Oh, and I posted the vlog. Um, I posted last week's vlog today, which is Friday, or last night. I posted it yesterday, th uh, Thursday. And um, y'all are too sweet. Y'all are, I cried a little bit, just a tad, um, about Angelo's dyslexia and stuff. And y'all are the sweetest, giving me very encouraging comments and telling me I'm the best mom. And I really appreciate that because... Um, I needed it. So, thanks. So, I'll see y'all next week. Bye.